the Sandvik PE-100. Matra, a Hungarian company, ordered this bucket wheel excavator to boost their annual production, which was already extracting 8.5 million tons annually. After deploying the Sandvik PE-100, the production increased to 12 million cubic meters per annum. It can extract various types of material. Its theoretical extraction capacity is 6,700 cubic per hour. The Sandvik PE-10 measures 24 m high and weighs 1650 tons, which is approximately equal to 9. Empty Boeing 747 ES. It features a 28-meter-long hydraulic arm that can reach a maximum height of 20 meters. The bucket wheel is also huge, measures 12 in diameter, and consists of 16 buckets with a total capacity of 29 cubic meters. The ER-1250 ECS from Microcontrol, which was designed for hard lignite extraction in open-pit mining operations. It provides a high rate of extracted rock mass through rail transportation or mining vehicles. The bucket excavator is capable of operating in temperatures as low as 40 degrees below zero. It is 48.5 meters long, 16 meters wide, and 22 meters tall and features a six, five meter diameter wheel. Its maximum extracting height is 17 meters, while its maximum digging depth is only one meter. This 675-ton excavator offers an hourly capacity of 2,000 cubic meters. The VDO Bucket Wheel Excavator, ThyssenKrupp, a German multinational company, is behind building this monstrous excavator. It has been put to use in nations like Thailand to dig for coal. It offers an extraction capacity of 7,500 cubic meters per hour and can dig through the toughest material layers. This bucket wheel excavator is the best alternative for the time-consuming and dangerous drill and blast machines that are often used when mining coal or other minerals. Its wheel is fitted with tightly spaced buckets that maximize output. Using a mobile conveyor, it can run non-stop on massive mining operations. Construction of the FAM SR-800 started in 2015 and took more than three years. It is currently in Chile at the Radomiro Atomic Mine, extracting tons of copper daily. In terms of size, FAM SR-800 measures 50 meters long and 25 meters high, while its operating weight is 1,000 tons. The diameter of its bucket wheel is 19 meters, which has 16 individual buckets. This giant excavator can extract at a maximum extraction rate of 14500 tons per hour. Its travel speed is 15 m per minute. The K2000 Bucket Wheel Excavator was built in 1987 in the Czech Republic to extract the natural deposits of the Belina mine. It combines extreme durability with a high digging force, making it ideal for use in the harsh environments of the mining industry. It has the capability of extracting 5,500 cubic meters per hour from a height of 35 meters. Using its two-meter-wide conveyor, it transports the material over distances. The wheel has a diameter of 13 meters and 15 buckets with a total capacity of 24 cubic meters.
Microcontrol CHRS 900. This machine was developed in Germany by Orenstein in Koppel. It has been used for coal mining in Poland for almost four decades and has been relocated to different mines during these years. Interestingly, its maximum travel speed is only 8 meters per minute. The SCHRS is 40 meters wide, 2,400 tons heavy, and can extract 4,100 cubic meters per hour of material. Its 10-meter diameter wheel has 14 buckets with a total capacity of 12.6 cubic meters. The UNXKU-800 is self, a propelled wheel excavator that was built in 1981. Since then, it has been extracting coal in the Czech Republic. It is 170 meters long and 52 meters tall and weighs 4, 30 tons. It is 170 meters long and 52 meters tall, weighing 4,300 tons. It has a 32 meter operating height. Thanks to its self-propulsion system, it can go at a maximum speed of 3 meters per minute on any terrain. The bucket wheel is 12.5 meters in diameter and has 15 buckets, providing a combined capacity of 15 cubic meters. The K2000 bucket wheel excavator was built in 1987 in the Czech Republic to extract the natural deposits of the Belina mine. It combines extreme durability with a high digging force, making it ideal for use in the harsh environments of the mining industry. It has the capability of extracting 5,500 cubic meters per hour from a height of 35 meters. Using its two-meter-wide conveyor, it transports the material over distances. The wheel has a diameter of 13 meters and 15 buckets with a total capacity of 24 cubic meters. You are looking at one of the world's largest bucket wheel excavators. Its name is RWE Bagger 281. The Orenstein and Koppel, a German engineering firm, constructed it in 1957. It has been used for coal mining in Western Germany and is presently owned by RWE Power. This bucket wheel excavator requires four operators to operate and can move at a maximum speed of 8 meters per minute. It is 171 meters long, 50 meters tall, has a wheel with a diameter of meters, and has 10 buckets with a total capacity of 22.5 cubic meters. It can remove 110,000 cubic meters of material each day and weighs 3,850 tons.
you are looking at one of the world's largest bucket wheel excavators. Its name is the R. Ray Wee Bagger 293. It was built by the Tackraff firm in 1995 and is used for mineral coal mining in Germany. The Bagger 293 measures 225 meters long and stands 96 meters tall. The total weight of this monster is 14,200 tons. Its maximum traveling speed is 10 meters per minute. In terms of size, its bucket wheel is 21.6 meters with 18 buckets and a total capacity of 118 cubic meters. It's the heaviest machine on the planet and can move 240,000 cubic meters of cargo per day. Did you learn something new? Smash that like button and subscribe for more awesome content.